As soon as I saw the title, Cinema Paradise, I immediately thought of that older Italian film, Cinema Paradiso, or Cinema Paradiso, uh, which was pretty prolific for its time. Uh, still a great film. Check that out if you haven't already. I wonder if that's where Zero Base One got the title from, Cinema Paradise. I could only imagine, yes, we got a brand new film, a brand new teaser film for Zero Base One's brand new era, which is right around the corner with their fourth mini album, Cinema Paradise. Bad. Why is the film called Bad? Are we getting a bad version of Zero Base One? I don't know, bro, but I am so excited to check this out. Now, this is two minutes and 45 seconds. And uh, normally for a teaser film, I would watch it on my own, not in front of the camera, and do a reaction to it. <laughs> uh, for some groups, I do make exceptions, and Zero Base One is one of those groups. But also, two minutes and 45 seconds is usually the length of any given song nowadays. So it's like reacting to a music video. <laughs> uh, guys, let's get into the Zero Base One with Bad their brand new teaser film. And here we go. It's an actual film. It's a film real. That's one of their songs, one of their new songs, right? Ah. Loving you. Whoa. Made me realize. Oh, Matthew's narrating. Ah, bad. Ew. Every last drop of you. Oh. Keeps me alive. Like what? So I changed. Even if it means losing myself. I knew it was Ricky. I don't know why. I don't know how. I knew it was Ricky. Wow. Oh my God, Ganook, no! Tay Ray's blonde? Just like a spider crawling itching at my skin. I couldn't shake you off because I fear losing you would hurt more than losing myself. Wow. <laughs> Am I afraid of change? Whoa, what is this, a shining? <gasps> wow. What the fuck? <gasps> You're mine. Han, but <gasps> Ganook's hair is purple? My boy's hair is purple? Nice. I see what you guys did. Nice. Wow. That was so ominous and so different from anything we've seen, but also felt from Zero Base One before. Wow. You know, I'm thinking of their very first teaser film, and uh, they played around with the whole concept of being like in a simulation, right? And this is very different from that. Uh, this is horror, straight up horror visuals. And I'm a huge horror fan. It is my favorite film genre. And I could go on and on and on and on about that genre because I love it so much. <laughs> I know the horror genre gets such a bad rap and it has since its existence. You can literally say whatever you want to say and do whatever you want to do within the horror genre. There are no bounds. There are no limits to that genre. 
that's what makes it so great. You can have things that are really heavy with like social commentary, political commentary, or no commentary whatsoever. And that's the beauty and variety of the horror genre. And here we have, I guess, what we would call K-pop horror. <laughs> oh my God, we got to do this again. I did not think that we were going to get a narration, uh, much less from Matthew. He has such a great voice. He has such an incredible voice with narrating and, I guess, telling us a story. Wow. Well, I mean, I already knew he had a great voice with singing, but for narrating, voice work, he is so fucking good, bro. My Canadian bro. <laughs> Let's do this again. Whoa, so much in such a short amount of time. Okay, we have a film reel. Oh, this is so pretty with the flower. And then Cinema Paradise. So the, oh, very The Shining. And if you've seen The Shining, you would know The Shining. Hand in hand, I love that. Is there any significance with the blue around them? The blue string wrapped around them? Hmm. Let's see, parking lot. Yeah, we see that film reel. Again, the burning. What is burning though? Is it the film? No, oh, here's the rope again, the blue rope. <sighs> Whoa! That is so fucking cool. Holy shit, wait. See, you gotta go through this. Bit by bit. The hair, bro, jet black hair. Oh my God, Matthew. Great acting. Look at his eyes. There, that blink before he reaches for the film reel. That, that blink, I love that. Love that. He's animating his thought process. Like, that is so fucking great. I actually want to go through this shot by shot. Frame for frame. Um, so right here, he looks at the film reel. And when he blinks, this, this moment right here is when he decides, huh, this is interesting, curious. Let me take this and watch it. Like that is what's happening right there. Oh, he's so good. So the music's already playing, and is this, the, is this the title track? None of us knows. I'm, I don't know who I'm asking. <laughs> who can answer? I don't know, because we don't know. <laughs> it probably most likely, I mean, it could be any song off the album, right? We don't know, but. Mm. Loving you. This is fucking, oh, ah, oh, ee, ah. oh my God. This is so crazy and sad, but so beautiful at the same time. Hey. Oh, okay, wait, ooh, ah, we begin with. Loving you. Loving you. The, oh my God, looks like, they look like little crystals in his eyes. The tears, the water look like crystals. Unless they are crystals in the eyelashes. Wow, it's so pretty. Made me realize. Made me realize, oh! The sound of dripping water. Made me realize. Makes me thirsty. Ah! Two, ja! Made me oh, realize. These, ah! Oh my god, I didn't notice that there was a spider on this heart cake. Um, I just saw that like <laughs> something was happening to it, but I didn't notice it was an actual spider until now. This is so sad, this cake. I mean. The spider seems to like it. <laughs> made me realize. Every Loving you made me realize every last every last drop of you, the heart. Oh, this is so cute. Every last drop of you. The way he says that every last drop of you. Every last drop of you. It sounds like he's about to cry and he's holding back his tears. He's holding back his full display of emotions there. And uh, yeah, 
Suck Matthew is taking us to school, acting school, ladies and gentlemen. Every last drop of you. Ooh, what is with these spikes? Ah, kiss me. Ooh, ah, Five. kiss me. I love the eye. Ooh, cat eyes, cat eyes. We just got a bunch of cat eyes in uh in hyping <laughs> the new music video. <laughs> Every last drop of you. Who? I can't really tell who's. Uh, uh, is this Ganook? Although Ganook has like purple hair right now, guys. I don't see purple here, but I don't know who this is. I'm sorry. This isn't Matthew, is it? I don't. I'm sorry. I can't really tell. I'm sorry. Keeps me alive. Is it? Ma <gasps> his arm. What happened to his? This is the thumbnail. This is how. And how did he get his arm cut up like that? Ah! Holding onto like the chest water. again. Uh, like water? Like water. A lot of hearts lit up in this video. So I changed. So I changed. Was there... Okay. Wait one second. Was there not a phone booth in their very first teaser film? before their debut. Am I imagining that? I feel like there was. Has almost everybody dyed their hair jet black for this era? I think they have. We got to get to Ricky. Oh my God, we got to get to Ricky. But Eugene has black hair, jet black hair. Okay, Suck Matthew, black hair, jet black hair. How? Black hair, jet black hair. Okay, who's he calling? Even if it means losing myself. Even if it means losing myself, unknown. I knew this was Ricky. I think it was the shoes. I don't know if it was the shoes, but the walk. It was definitely the walk. Yeah. Whoa. Like, what is flying around him like that? There are shots in some horror films where the entity, the antagonist, it, like, we're getting their POV and... um. What's a great movie that does this? Is it Witchboard? It might be Witchboard. Look that up. I think it's Witchboard. And the entity, you never really see what the entity is, but you get their POV and it's like this. They're like flying through rooms and shit like that, attacking whoever in that scene is getting attacked. Really fucking cool. Oh, it's just so scary. Oh, he, okay. Okay, so we need to talk about this. I have said for the longest time, we are eventually going to get Ricky with black hair. Now, is his natural hair color this jet black? Maybe, maybe not. My hair is pretty dark, but and this is my natural hair color. <laughs> but uh, this is as close as it's probably ever going to get to his natural hair color. And uh, we're getting it now. We've got it once before, briefly, but we're getting it again now. And uh, yeah, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Wow, look at that. Oh. Still in theme, I think, with their whole simulation type of deal, because it looks like a simulation to me. That's ooh, oh the sound effects. Listen to that. And then that right after with the ticking. Ooh, cuts like a knife. Oh, I threw the lock hole. Amazing. Again, oh no, again. See, from the POV of the entity chasing whoever this is right now, I guess this is Ganook. Wow. Let me move that. Ah, ooh. Crazy how tight we are on him like that. Love this car. We have Tay Ray. 
Tayray, I think, has the lightest hair in this video. I gotta see everybody else, but Tayray, blonde Tayray. Whoa! Okay. Have you guys ever seen the movie Enemy? Filmed right here in Toronto, starring Jake Gyllenhaal. Enemy. Oh my god. That movie is fucking wild. As soon as I saw this, that is exactly what I thought of. Enemy. Look at this imagery. So creepy. So crazy. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Just like a spider crawling, itching at my skin. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Just like a spider crawling, itching at my skin. His voice. Oh my god. The smoke. Just like a spider crawling, itching at my skin. Wow, he's like disintegrating. Just I love the way he speaks here. Just like a spider. Just like a spider crawling, itching at my skin. What are these? Oh, these are flowers. Oh, blue. Yeah, mm-hmm, uh-huh, mm-hmm, uh-huh. I couldn't shake you off because... Hot bit. I fear losing you. No! Uh, Jiung! G. okay. Wait, so Tayray has bleach blonde hair. And I know this might all change with the lighting, right? Especially blonde hair, white blonde hair, like it changes with the lighting. Um, Jiyoung, wow. Has this been the lightest he's gone since their debut? I think, I think so. I think so, but it's funny that he, he picks up the flower, the glass with the flower that uh, uh, closely resembles his hair. <laughs> Would hurt more than losing myself. Wow, ooh, wait, blue, is it blue here? No. I couldn't shake you It's the one because... white flower that he picks up. I fear losing you. <gasps> what is happening? What is happening with his skin, bro? You might wanna check that out. I have a great doctor that can I help fear you. <laughs> hurt more than losing myself oh my god it turns blue ah fear losing it you. didn't want to start <laughs> so he starts turning blue from the inside and then the flower losing once it's oh he's biting on it it's white and then myself. it starts turning blue oh amazing oh okay so Half the members have lighter hair. <laughs> the other half have jet black hair. Okay, there's like dark side and light side happening in this video. This is a beautiful shot. Am I afraid of change? Whoa, wait, wait, wait. I thought his hair was black. It's lighter now. But Hanbin. This is the lightest we've ever seen Hanbin. I, yeah. Yeah, wow. Very, everybody looks so zombie-esque. Oh, oh my god. Oh, shit. Am I afraid of change? Am I afraid of change? This seems to be a very dark, scary change. Ooh, ah, ooh, the fire, the fire. Looking on one side, looking on the other side, in the middle, upside down. Ooh, the fire, the umbrella. The umbrella's on fire. Oh, no. no. So the hair is not, oh, the hair is red. The hair, but wait, who is in the beginning? So we're still focused on how in this shot, in this scene, I should say earlier in the video, I thought this was Eugene. I genuinely thought this was Eugene. My apologies, but this looks like Eugene. Like, I'm sorry. <laughs> but you see, Eugene is the only one that has red hair in this video. So is this not him then opening his eyes earlier in this video? This is Eugene, right? And this is Eugene. As well. Right? Gilvin! It was Gilvin! Oh my fuck. Wow.
Neither am I. Oh! He looks so good with the red hair, guys. Wow. This is why I gotta go through this twice. Wait a minute. What the f- So, wait, Tayra's hair is pink now! They're fucking me up with that. <laughs> They're f fucking me up! Oh my god. You see, but Ganook did not have purple hair when he was being covered by those veins, viney shit. I don't... <laughs> Very evil dead. That scene. Ugh. Hanbin looks so good with his hair like this. Do you think there's um a reason, a rhyme or reason as to why some are sitting beside each other and some aren't? I love how they have Hao and Hanbin sitting beside each other. Number one and number two. Okay. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> That's crazy. Like watching their own film. Their names in the credits. Narration, narration written by Sok Matthew. I didn't book that. Whoa! Nice. Nice. Good job, Matthew. We love to see it. Wow. Wow. That sound is, is so creepy. Like the room temperature sound there. Oh, man. Guys, what did you think of this bad film? This film was anything but bad. It was fucking amazing this is a whole different type of vibe for zero base one i am so excited to see what they have else in store for us with this album cinema paradise i feel like we're going to get a lot of callbacks or a lot of homages to films in general horror or otherwise i feel like with this era i don't know i don't know but a lot of horror tropes and tactics used in this bad film i'm loving this so so much cannot wait for this album guys let me know what you thought of this bad film answer any and all questions i may have had uh i know i kind of lost my mind with this but <laughs> this is why i like going through things twice to really hammer down uh what everything means to the best of my abilities um in this short amount of time anyways so yeah I uh, would love to hear from you. Guys, that's going to be it for today. Thank you so very much for spending all this time with me as I check out some more Zero Base One. Until then, take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. We'll speak again real soon. Peace.